Hello guys and welcome to the fourth episode of OPC UA tutorial series. In this episode we will be using a Raspberry Pi and we will configure it as a server and as a client. So the good part about the library which we are using for OPC UA is that its code is universal. You can use it for Windows and you can use that same exact code for Linux. So I have connected my Raspberry Pi with an Ethernet cable directly to my Windows 10 laptop. So I will connect the Raspberry Pi using VNC Viewer. So this is the IP address of my Raspberry Pi. I will connect to it. Okay. Before running the same server code which we have written in our Eclipse, we, we need to install few of the libraries. So first we will update our Pi. Now we will install few libraries. I have already installed this, so it's showing it's the newest version. Now you need to install cryptography. And at last you need to install free OPC UA Python package. I have also installed this but you can run this command to install OPC UA Python package. This command can take a lot of time to install like 20-30 uh, minutes. So after installation you can verify it by running the python3 command prompt and by importing the module. So if, if this gives error that means it is not been installed but if it runs successfully like this that means OPC UA has been installed in your Pi. Next thing you need to do is to change the IP address in the server code because now the IP address has been changed. Uh, let's see the IP address. You can use ifconfig command. So I'm, I'm actually connected to the wireless and also I have connected an Ethernet cable and the IP address which we have is this one. So I will write this IP address in my server code. So let's open the server code. Okay, here I have already written the server, uh, the IP address in the URL. Now let's close this and run the server example. Okay, the server has started. Let's open our UA expert to connect to the server which is running on Raspberry Pi. So we'll add a server. Here you have to mention the IP address which I've already written here. Click OK. Connect. Here is our node and these are our variables. So this is all about writing a simple server example, running a simple server example on a Raspberry Pi. You can use this as in your uh, electronics project like you can connect sensors on any other input output electronics devices to the Raspberry Pi. Then you can program your program the server, add your logic into it and you can use this OPC UA protocol to start your server. So as you can see the values are updating in the real time in the UA expert software. 
So this is all about how to install OPC UA in Raspberry Pi and how to run the same exact code on the server, server code in the Raspberry Pi. In the next tutorial, we will start with a client and we will configure our Raspberry Pi as a client. Then we will start server on our Windows laptop. So thank you for watching this video. Please like, share, subscribe and comment if you have any questions regarding OPC UA.